Good day everyone, so this is Alvin again from the Philippines and welcome to another edition of Miss Universe 2019 Contestants Profile Review and Analysis and today I am going to talk about Miss Universe Chile 2019 and since Chile belongs to the Americas, here is my current ranking for that region. And that ranking is currently based on my fifth leaderboard for the Miss Universe 2019 pageant. So if you have not seen my latest leaderboard, I will be posting the link on the description below. So let's begin. And by the way, before I proceed, there will be an updated ranking at the end of this video if for any reason the Chile makes it in my personal top 10. So let's begin. Chile started competing in 1952. They have already won once, and that was with Cecilia Boloco in 1987. Their latest placement was in 2004, with Gabriela Barros finishing in the top 15. This year, they just crowned Geraldine Gonzalez. She's 19 years old, and she stands 5'9". She was second runner-up in Miss Universe Chile 2019, and then came back this year and finally won Miss Universe Chile 2019. Profile-wise, Geraldine is a law student, a volunteer firefighter, and developed a social program with migrant women with support of the municipality of Conchali. What's exciting is we have actually a lot of law students and lawyers in this edition of Miss Universe. I also love her profile, especially the firefighting because it's really unique and blazing the trail that women can do it as well. For her national performance, even during the introduction, this woman just knows how to charm the audience with how she carry and present herself. During the swimsuit competition, Aside from the fact that she's got an amazing figure, she's also got a strong walk. I mean, of course, I would love to see a more impactful walk, but what she did during the, her national performance was already great. During the evening gown competition, I really liked the choice of her gown, and in some way, I thought she was Jacqueline Oliveira, Miss Universe Brazil 2013, with her pink gown minus the thing on her arms, but she looked really, really stunning in it. I also love her walk at that round. She looked really elegant. For her final question, I did not understand any of it, so, sub so same as the others, hopefully someone would post in the comment in the comment section the translated answer of her during the national pageant and i already want to thank you in advance if you will for chile this year she is a strong contender with some few with some few polishings to be done and also i think she looked beautiful in motion and she's got a lot of beautiful photos as well so far she's actually one of my favorite candidates from chile in the recent years one thing though is that chile has been sending decent representatives almost every year and i do commend them for that however they need to elevate on how they prepare their girls even more because sometimes something is just lacking with their representatives i mean they're good but not good enough to get a placement so hopefully this will be a good year for chile because i really really like geraldine a lot so having said that here is my updated ranking for the americas my number 10 is panama ninth is aruba 8 venezuela 7 for el salvador and my number six as of the moment is chile number five usa for mexico three colombia two brazil and my number one still is puerto rico madison anderson so if you wanted to check my reviews of the other contestants and of course the other contestants from other regions you can just go ahead and check on my channel or i have also created a personalized playlist where you can watch all of my reviews of the miss universe 2019 contestants selected so far so what do you think don't forget to leave your comments below don't forget to give a thumbs up and share the video as well and most importantly don't forget to subscribe because you'll be seeing more of this videos in the future so for now thank you very much and have a wonderful day from the philippines